How's it going YouTube? Just another follow up from the Python and Android um, tutorial. Um, I'm going to elaborate, I'm going to um, play with a couple of things, a couple of variables on this. So how do we run our own scripts? Um, well basically I've created, for example, okay, a folder in um, on my SD card called Scapy Scripts. All right. Um, I've put a test.py in there. And if we open this up and we have a little look with a text viewer what we're doing is we're just importing scapey um, import all um, we're creating an ether packet um, art packet and we're sending a request getting a response okay and printing out the response that's all um, we're going to run into a little problem as you're going to see okay but don't be afraid to play with the file system okay don't be afraid to break things otherwise you're not going to learn anything okay so um, let's try and run this and see what happens so if we do a python now I might actually switch to ADB wireless um, in a minute as well just to make this a bit easier so what was it actually you know what I'm gonna do that mm, should I do that now no right so SD card forward slash and we had scapey scripts now you can guess what the error is going to be that's good so we've got test.py okay no module name scapey at all okay obviously it's looking for scapey it doesn't know where it is so what we can do is we can just navigate to um, the qpython package where it has scapey all right and if we um, click the egg okay all we need is this folder here that's it that's all we need so if we just take that and we copy it and we go back to our folder that we created on our SD card and we paste this here now if you're building an APK also all you have to do is just literally just put the scapey folder um, with your APK in the root directory and um, Bulldozer and Kivi, if you're using that for the GUI, will be able to see it and you can use it. But as I said, you will not be able to um, call it from your APK unless you know a way of doing that. It's not going to work, right? Uh, I haven't been able to get it to work anyway. So now, if we it would help if I had the um, up button, let me see if that works. Come on, turn it over. No, let me see if we've got a no, we haven't okay let's just call it anyway so we have uh, python um, forward slash no sd card sd card sd card forward slash JP scripts forward slash test dot py that should run just fine let's get rid of the keyboard as you can see it's called the uh, the, the test script perfectly fine so you can build your own um, application using that you can run your own scripts from the SD card okay as long as you um, put it in another folder and Google wants me to speak that's just um, uh, spooky anyway so all you have to do is just put the, uh, the relevant folder this will work with I've actually tried it with a net address folder as well that works okay so that's just how to run your own scripts uh, from the terminal on your Android using the qpython um, terminal uh, there's more tutorials coming and map on Android as well is coming up um, pretty fast thanks for watching guys keep coding keep being awesome see ya